is Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. Oh crap, I just said his name and now he's gonna appear. Beetlejuice 2 tells the story of three generations of the Dietz family having to return back home after a tragic family member died and they return back to the house where it all started and Linda Dietz's rebellious daughter gets into all sorts of trouble with the mysterious portal and Beetlejuice returns to wreak his goofy, goofy, off-the-wall havoc all over again. This movie has been 36 years in the making, and I watched the original for the very first time earlier this week to get acquainted and ready to go for this movie. And I am so glad I did because this movie was worth the wait. This movie is a prime example of doing a anticipated sequel after decades off. Yeah, I'm looking at you, Hocus Pocus 2. This movie is done with so much love for the fans. Tim Burton does it once again. There are so many cool Easter eggs in this movie. Like, say, for example, mixing the old cast with the new cast, but not having the old cast take over the entire movie. There is life in this movie, ladies and gentlemen. Michael Keaton takes Beetlejuice and revs it up to 9,000. And Miss Ryder, who plays Linda from the old movie, comes back to this new movie. Now she's a mother of her own and she is trying to deal with the trauma that Beetlejuice still haunts her with up until this point, while raising a rebellious teenage daughter who was played by Jenna Ortega. And by the way, Jenna Ortega does a wonderful job in this movie, as well as William Defoe, who is this undead, dead detective, who is an actor in the same time, and the corkiness is off the wall. Me and my theater were laughing the entire time. Mostly at Beetlejuice, by the way. Because Beetlejuice is a freaking riot in this film. Even the unnecessary story plots in this movie don't derail from the fun. The pacing in this movie is done very well. Shout out to the person who was next to me in my showing. They were dressed up as Beetlejuice and it was a freaking hoot. Guys, if you're looking for a fun, wacky, corky movie to start the fall season with, go see Beetlejuice. It is good for the entire family, it's good for newbies, it's good for diehard Beetlejuice fans. <clears throat> My entire showing was sold out for a Thursday afternoon. That is the power of Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, don't say his name three times or he appears. Okay, we're good. He's not here. Guys, I encourage you to go see this film. And while you're at it, make sure that you get all... Because the juice is loose. And if you enjoyed my thoughts on this review and movie, make sure to smack the video with a like. And comment down below, are you going to go see this movie? And if you have seen this movie, what are your initial thoughts 
about it. And if you've seen that third act, let me know what you think. Because I think I know where we're going moving forward. But I don't want to spoil it for anybody who hasn't seen the movie yet. And I will link my Beetlejuice review over here for the retro one. And if you enjoyed movie review, guys, I'm your guy right here. So consider subscribing to the channel. And I'll see you guys on the next movie review. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice!